Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Nino Kuni 2, Revenant Kingdom. We're headed for the Chief Engineer's office. It's a pretty, pretty bland little office you got here. At least he keeps his desk clean. <laughs> welcome to where I work and sleep sometimes. Hey, oh, it's her office. Never mind. <laughs> I didn't mean to insult your office. Uh, feels like I haven't been here in a long time. It looks like you haven't been there in a long time. It looks like it's never getting used. Let me just grab that memolith. Oh, she keeps it in the safe. You obtained Bracken's personal law. I bet it's going to be them two, like, kind of having a little bit of a relationship. What's on it, Bracken? Well, uh, I guess you could say it contains one of the most important memories of my whole life. Golly. Really? Golly. Anyhow, with this and the others, we should have more than enough to make Zip snap out of it. He'll be in the reactor control room. Come on. It's upstairs. Come on. Man, everything is upstairs. How many stairs are there? Oh, look at the little the little guy, little Higgledy was in my way. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. The pistons pumping up. Pump up the jam. Pump it up. Get your pistons pumping. And your Evan jumping. Nailed it. All right, let's go in here. This elevator should take, take us up to the control room. Uh-oh. Blimey. What's going on? I'd say somebody isn't too keen on us coming knocking. We're going to have to fight some big monster thing. I just know it. Here we go. Oh, man. Oh, man. The obliterator. Oh, this is going to be this is going to be tough. Good luck, okay. Everyone. Okay. 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 Oh, get out of the way, everybody. Oh, Roland just got wrecked. Okay, okay, let's go. Okay, that's good. I'll take it. I'm counting on you. All right, okay. Ooh, that was nice. Get wrecked. Okay, we're gonna do okay. We're gonna do okay with this one, I think. I'm just gonna like sort of kite him. I'm gonna just aim at him first. Oh, she's using her little thing. That's good. Let's get some dark magic up in this. Up in this mother. <laughs> oh, whoa. That hurt. Ah! Dang it! What the heck? How am I supposed to? I just—I guess I could just block. It. I still—I still get wrecked. I'm counting on you. Okay, come on. I know I didn't stand in the thing. Okay. Nice. We did some damage there. I need your help. Fire some stuff at them, please. Or at him, not them. Oh, you got a little bit wrecked there, Bracken. Oh, he's doing it again, isn't he? Hey! Get him fast! You do the thing! Nice! Look at all these moves! Okay. Out of there. Nope. You're not getting me. Oh, no. Not this again. I'm blocking, but not very well. Oh man, okay, wait. Three leafed sore away. Beautiful. Four leafed sore away. Whoa, I didn't I never even noticed that. Let's give one to you too. And let's go with the uh, strong sixth sixth sensor. I can't that's like Whoa. a tongue twister and a half. Fireball him. Out of the way, out of the way. Oh no, not again. Something terrible is about to happen. Okay, he's knocked out. Everybody put pressure on him! Nice! Doing a great job, guys. Hit him with the water. Oh, here we go again. No, no, no. Oh, he's almost dead again. Three leaf sore away. I'm probably... Oh. I'm probably supposed to do that a little bit better. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead. He's done. He's done! Whew. Nailed it. Let me get this thing. That thing meant business. Yeah, no kidding. Well, it's gone now. Let's go see Zip. <laughs> well, she's very, like, nonchalant about... You've obtained a swift plunder bus. Ooh. I know you... Oh, there it is. Very nice. And you can now use the watery thing. The hammer looks good. Uh, we don't have to give um, Bat 
two or whatever the heck his name is. Anything new? She should use something new, actually. Right there. And right there. What about your bow? You're still good with the bow. Uh, I guess you can... Where's that feisty? This one? Is that the one? Here, use that one. It's better. And then, of course, you've got the bow. Still good. How about your sword there, Evan? You're still kind of good. Not really. The accursed savior sword. Use the savior sword, please. And the gloomy sword is way outdated. Use the other savior sword. And then you've got the good, the good wand. What about the armor? Everybody's good, pretty much. The boots. Okay, we're good. We're fine. It's fine. All right, we're going this way. Banu. Banu. Testing floor, uh, roof slash king's cradle. Yes, that's what we want. I'm afraid the roof is off limits unless you have authorization from President Vector himself. Huh? Head for the reactor control room in the factory. Oh, maybe we gotta go... Wait. Reactor floor. That's where we gotta go. Okay. Like I said, very um, open world linear. <laughs> uh, here we go. This is it. This is the big moment. Hopefully he remembers the good side of him. It's very silent. Very hey. awkward. Zip, we need to talk. He's busy with his dumb haircut. Gah! Gah, really? So you're the intruders, huh? Makes sense, I guess. Who else could have gotten around my security measures but you, right, Bracken? President Vector, there is something you need to see. Gah. Huh? <laughs> Show him the memo, it's Bracken. I almost said Bracken. I kind of did say Bracken. Time for a trip down memory lane. Zip. This is Can't the final wait to one. get the crystal battery up and running. This thing's going to be a game changer for the energy business. The technology we build here today will make a better tomorrow for everybody. I can feel it. Someday soon, the world will finally understand my vision. We're not giving up until that day comes. Hey, hey, I couldn't have done it without you guys. This was a team effort. Don't forget that. I know I won't. Soon, we'll be the biggest and best this world has ever seen. Just one last push. Are you with me? I think the next one is the new one that we didn't get to see. Oh. Uh, huh. Gah. I was... Why was I... I, I, I don't... There's one last memory okay, I want to show go. you. Here we go. This is the one. I bet they Please. were romantically involved. You have to remember who you used to be. You have to bring the old Zip back. Uh... So I stayed up all night making this for you? Did she lose her leg? <laughs> How about that, huh? A custom leg made just for you by the world's greatest engineer. You're, you're, you're gonna love it. This isn't my leg. I want my leg. I want my... No, I, I, I get it, Bracken. I, I get that you're upset, but... We're engineers. We solve humanity's problems. We use technology to help people. That's our purpose. That's what we do. Now, do you, do you really want a, a little thing like this to stop you from fulfilling that purpose? I... We solve humanity's problems. And we solve each other's, too, right? Um, you lose a leg, I make you a new one. I lose a hand. Well, you know, I, I hope you do the same for me. Oh, Zip. Well, and this leg... It's not just a machine. I put my heart and soul into it. It's it's uh, it's a part of me. That's really sweet of him. Thank you. Hey, uh, I'm your boss. It's my job. I think he wants to be more than a boss. Am I right? He wants to be a boss. <laughs> I look, Zip. Look at it. Look at the little guy. You've seen the things we can do these days. I could have upgraded it. I could have gotten rid of the leg you made me. But I would never do that. 
This leg? This leg is what gave me the courage to carry on. What got me where I am today. I... I... You were the best engineer, the best boss, the best friend anyone could have. You had a good heart. The best. You have to remember. You have to. Oh, here we go. Yeah. It's the snakehead, dude. It's Dol Dol Dolomin? Sol Sola something? I I remember now. I remember everything. I remember now. Oh. I, I still, he's still remember everything. His what, what, what have I done? Zip, it's you, isn't it? The real you. You're back. Brack and I. I'm so sorry. If it wasn't for you, I, I don't think I, I ever would have remembered. Uh oh, I think we're gonna have to fight that. Oh no! Oh, what is going on? Bastion! That's a lot of explosions. Oh! This is not good. This can't be good, right? <laughs> Gears falling out of the sky? That can't be good. Oh man, those look heavy. The whole place is going down. Whoa! Bastion's back online. Damn it. If he reaches the reactor, he could trigger a total meltdown. And if that happens, Broadleaf and everything around it will be gone in an instant. What? What? Then we have to stop him. You'll have to find him first. He's equipped with full optical camouflage. Dang. I can't see him on any of my monitors, but judging by the patterns of interference, I'd say there's a good chance he's on top of the tower. Of course he is. The elevator will take us to the roof. Come on! That's where we just were. Or where we just tried to go. Objective updated. So, anything uh, to grab here? Just, uh, just, I know there's a sense of urgency, but, uh, maybe, uh, maybe I want to explore a little bit. Just kidding. Uh-oh. Blimey! You're kidding! Well... This is unfortunate. The path to the elevator. How are we going to get to the top now? Arr, we've no time for this. Calm down, everybody. There must be a way. Think. <laughs> I like how they all like, hmm. Hmm. Aha. I've got it. If we can divert enough power into the reactor's high-pressure inlets, it might just generate a field of sufficient integrity to... to trigger a pattern G chain reaction. Of course! Which would enable us to turn light into solid matter. Maybe only temporarily, but still. We could use it to make some kind of stairway to the top. What are they talking about? Good to have you back, Zip. Only the old you could have thought of something like that in a pinch. But there's just one thing. I know, it's only a hypothesis, but that'll have to do. All right, so we got to do uh, what to the thingamabob for the... Attention all team Ooh, members. What's it? I need you to channel all available power into the reactor's high-pressure inlets right now. But, but, President Vector, they weren't designed to take that kind of punishment. And you know what that means better than anybody. The reactor will go critical and the core will fuse. In other words, we'll wind up with the world's most expensive hunk of junk. Are you sure about this, Zip? She's your baby. It's that or risk the lives of every person in this country. You think I'd hesitate for even one second? I'm the executive director of this company and the leader of this nation. Nothing is more important than my people. So flood the damn tubes. That's an order. You heard yes, him, boys. Sir. For Broadly. That's just ridiculous. <laughs> what? That's a little bit. I mean, oh even for a JRPG, goodness. that's a bit of a stretch. Incredible. Now we can get to the top. How does. Uh, oh boy. Reactor level is critical. All available energy has been channeled into the high pressure inlets. All right. 
Hi. Nice work, everybody. Now get out of here and get the people someplace safe. But sir, the reactor is totally unstable. If we leave now, then there'll be nothing to... Hey. Who do you think you're talking to? If anyone in this country can keep that thing under control, it's me. But Mr. President, on your own? Ha. Huh. Sure, on my own. I could do it with my eyes closed. Oh, wow. <clears throat> He's modest. You really mean it, don't you? Well, all right then. We'll make sure everybody else is out okay. Good luck, President Vector. Or as I like to call him, p -Vect. All right, are we going uh, up those uh, magical stairs? No, apparently not yet. I'll stay here and look after the reactor. If I put even a single foot wrong, it's good night for all of us. But I won't. You guys should go shut Bastion down. I'll handle things here. We'll leave right away. Good luck, p -Vect. Come on, everybody, to the top of the tower. All right, here we go. Bye. Huh? -do 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 -do. Oh, here we go. That was a quick trip up the tower. Or up the stairs There's to the tower. Be around here somewhere. Um, oh. oh, boy. Here we go. Man, if that little robot guy wasn't bad enough, he sure will be now. Are we in a different place? Bastion, the four-legged fortress. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to pause let's the game right look. away. I'm going to, uh, let's see, sardine sandwich, simply improve magical defense, okay. Makes critical hits more likely, okay. Boop, boop, boop. We'll do critical hits, more likely. Now let's go. Okay, that hurt. What is happening right now? There's a weak spot. Come on, come on. But this guy doesn't seem too hard so far. And hey, where's the other weak spot? Oh, what the heck are those things? These little machiney thingies. But do something about them, Evan, my lad. Okay, I will try. Okay. Oi, Oi Evan. Hig makers. Okay, that's good. Okay, this guy's getting ready to do something here. Here we go, here we go. Uh-huh, uh-huh, do your thing. There's three cannons pointing, pointing at him. There's another one around here somewhere. Here, let's get the healy. The heal job. Where's the weak spot right now? I don't see the weak spot. So I'll just keep attacking him. Oh, oh, he hurt. He hurt. Let me go over this way. Oh, I didn't get there in time. I can't even see what I'm doing. Oh, boy. Okay. Ouch. Out of the way! Okay, oh, this isn't good. This can't be good. This can't be good! I'm trying to take this guy out. Oh, he's dead! Uh oh. Uh oh. <gasps> Restores. Oh, I don't have any more of those things. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. Okay. Let's restore Roland's magic. Um, let's do a four-leafed sore away for her, a three-leafed sore away for me, and now I'm in some trouble. Show us what you got. I want to switch. Here we go, Roland. Do something right there. That's where we want it. Oh, he's almost dead. We might, we might live through this. Oh, here's the new place. Here goes. Look at all that damage. Keep going. We're almost there. Woo. We did it with Evan on the ground. Oh. 
I think it's... Not so fast. Oh no, there's gonna be a round two. I thought that was way too easy. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me, and Evan- Wait a minute, Evan's alive now. Oh, that's good. No. Yes. Okay, can we... Let's give him... Who's resistant to confusion? Resistance to freezing? Improves magical defense? I don't think there's any magical defense to be had here. But why not? Give it to him. Alright, what are we doing? Oh, I ran right into that like an idiot. Oh, oh, out, 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 out. How do I... Okay, he's turning around. What the heck? What are you firing at, dude? Need a little help here. I don't understand what's happening. There's a cutscene in the middle of the battle? What? How can this be happening? I don't know, man, but we better get out of your, out of your something. No. Evan. Evan. What is going I on? I understand now. What? A leader must be willing to give his life to protect his people. That's what Zip is planning to do. But I'm not going to let him. Not now. I won't run away. Oh not boy. Again. Not ever. Oh no, this is this is bad news. Oh, oh he's he's upset. Oh Are we finally gonna see the ultimate power of Lisa Simpson? Holy crap, that thing looks awesome. What do we do now? Lofty! Is it... Is it really you? Amazing! You're amazing! Bastion doesn't stand a chance! Go on, Lofty! Show us your true power! What is happening hey. right now? Aha! Uh -huh. I don't really know what's going on. What is this? Oh! Exactly. Oh boy! Wait a minute, it's just Evan? What the heck? This is ridiculous. Okay, hold on. Let me get it down here. I need your help. I don't know how to get up there. Let's try this again. All right, here comes the zappings. Go, go. Oh, Jesus. Oh, going this way. This is weird. Oh, come on. Oh, no! You gotta be kidding me! I gotta start that all over again. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do here. I don't think I can actually damage him. I think I just gotta jump. Oh, barely made that. Now what? Oh, here we go. Oh, done like dinner. I'm so good at this game. The best. I totally knew what I was doing the whole time. I was just kind of fooling. I was messing with you guys. Look at Lofty. He looks exhausted in his little clubs for arms. Huh? He's got no fingers. 
Eh? Ah, oh, you're kidding! But you're... there oh. I was, just oh. getting used to being big and long and handsome again. Knickers! Don't hear him talk enough. He's actually got a pretty cool voice. I wish he would read all of his own lines so that I don't have to do it because he's very confusing to read. Okay, so we got the Bill Gates haircut guy, <laughs> Pvect. Um, it seems that you are only able to maintain your dragon, f dragonly form for a short while, Lofty. Exactly. Yes, my theory is that the King's Bond was strengthened, but only just enough. So you were able to regain your original form, Lofty, but only for a very short while. What? But, but, if Evan gets even more kingly and the bond gets stronger, I'll be able to do it for longer, right? Maybe even forever in the end. He just wants to be a Go dragon, looks son. super cool. Right, oh, Evan. Uh, you get kingin' your head off, my lad. That's an order. <laughs> he he, I will. Oh my god, that was weird. Um, I still can't believe you managed to take down Bastion. I don't know what could have happened if you did, if you hadn't. There's no way I would have been able to prevent the core from melting down. That's for sure. <laughs> well, all's well that ends well. <laughs> she seems to be like, well, whatever. We did our job. Uh, but you didn't have scare me. But you didn't have scare me with all that talk about the whole kingdom being wiped out. <sighs> Sorry, I, I can't believe things turned out this way. I built the reactor to try to help people, but to make life better, and instead I put everybody in danger. I'm no president. Sure you are, Pvect. I don't deserve to run this country. Oh, zip. Mm -hmm. What's that? Hey! Listen, everybody. Hmm? It's the crowd. It's the crowd. It's the people of the but, city. But I... Don't deserve to run this country, huh? I think the people might have something to say about that. President Vector, I came here originally to ask you something. You see, I'm trying to bring peace to our world. Real, lasting peace. But I will need your help to do it. Can I count on your support? After all that, if he says no, I would be very, very upset. Oh, I'm sure we can come to some kind of an arrangement. We'd need a preferential trade agreement, of course. Do you guys have an official technology partner? We do now. Oh. Well, that this is this is kind of weird. So I just have to talk to him now. What was the point of that? Why wouldn't they just automatically... Okay. Alright. I'm ready when you are. The sooner we get this pact signed, the better. Come on, let's do this. Alright, we're signing the pact. I think this is the second Let last nation? Let our nations nation? be joined for the sake of the world. Let the banners of war ne'er again be unfurled. United, United we, we stand, stand as, as one, one single, single land. land. Yeah, there's only one remaining after this. Ooh, that's a cool, that's a cool little thing. It reminds, well, it's not reminding me of Bastion. It is Bastion. So he's looking to bring back this horned one, and you're looking to stop him? Yes. And if we can join forces with the other kingdoms, we may just stand a chance. I see, and out of the big players, there's only Ding Dong Dell left now, huh? That could be difficult. Yes. <laughs> yes. But I can tell by your face, you're not gonna back down. Luckily, we'll be right behind you. You have my word, as President of Broadleaf. Thank you so much. You'll be going with our new friends, Bracken? She's joining the party yes, permanently. Mr. President. But is that really all right? Bracken's awfully important to your kingdom, isn't she? Sure, and she'll be important to yours too. I could hardly send some second-tier engineer to help our new partners now, could I? You heard the man. I'll be on hand for all your mechanical and technological needs from now on. From hair clips to airships, I'm your gal. From hair clips to airships? What does that even mean? Bracken joins the party permit. So President Vector was freed from the grip of his obsession. And Broadleaf became the next country to sign up to the Declaration of Interdependence. The Declaration of and Interdependence. not only that, I love it. But Evan found a new friend in Bracken Meadows, whose endless inventiveness was sure to help Evermore flourish as never before. Only one great nation now remained. 
Ding Dong Dell. Now, Ding Dong Dell was the nation in the original Nino Kuni, was it not? Am I crazy? It was a long time ago, but I'm pretty sure that was it. Oh, there's this kid again. So Lofty finally showed his true power. Yes, it was such a surprise. You never would have guessed from looking at him. He looked pretty awesome, not gonna lie. And everything seems to be settling down in Broadleaf too. It does, yes. President Vector is back to his old self. I'm sure he'll put his people first from now on. And his friends will learn to trust him again soon enough. The bond between them is too strong for them to hold a grudge. I only hope that I can forge such firm friendships. I have a long way to go before people look up to me like they do Zip, though. I'm nothing like him. It takes all kinds of kings to make a world. I think you should just keep doing what you're doing. Perhaps you're right. Hey, Evan. Have you ever thought about what you'd do if someone really close to you betrayed you? Excuse me? What? Oh, I was just wondering. Forget I asked. I don't like the sound of that. Absolutely saved my progress. What is happening here? This is what you need, right? <gasps> so, you managed to acquire it. Not that I expected any less. You are nothing if not dependable. <laughs> yeah, that's me. We good to go then. Who's there? Um... Crikey! <laughs> oh, what is going on? Chapter 7. A traitor in our midst. Uh-oh. Come on. It can't be true. What do you want in curse ye? I've, I've plenty to keep me busy without your little words in me ear, ye scurvy swab ye. Oh, gosh. Sorry, boss, but it's important. You'll be wanting to hear this. Ye can be sure of that. You see? I was about, I was about me business in the castle late last night when I happened upon a fishy scene indeed. A shady character clad all in robes, a chin wagon with old Roland there. Chinwagon means talking, I'm assuming. Um, and if I ain't mistaken, it was more than pleasantries that were that was changing hands. Seemed more like state secrets to me. <laughs> Roland, what poppycock is this you're peddling, man? You were sleeping on the job and had yourself a little dream is all. I swear it, boss. It's what I saw. I swear it on me life. <laughs> uh, and when he... Espied? Espied? And we, when he spied me lurking... They're listening. He came after me with a face black as thunder. I was lucky to escape with me gizzards. Mm. Hmm. Well, I ain't about to believe such a such things of one of our own without proof. But you seem convinced, matey. That's for certain. Very well. Keep a weather keep a weather eye on the swab. <laughs> see what you can see. Aye. Aye, aye, boss. That's all the tweaks to the research facilities implemented, Your Majesty. We've made a few improvements that should ensure that they're pretty much future-proof for now. Wow. I have to say, Brack, and things have come impressively far, impressively fast, since you arrived in town. <laughs> of course they have. Why else would you have made me would you have made me Minister of Ingenuity? Hmm. Bracken is an asset indeed. But we have made precious little headway in other areas, not least the question of how to encourage Ding Dong Dell to sign the declaration. Hmm. Yes, we can't even close we can't even get close to them, let alone convince them to hear us out. And with and with the horned one's resurrection surely growing closer with every passing day, we simply can't afford to let these petty differences divide us. Hmm. Forgive me. Ah, there was something I wish to speak to you to with you all about. What's this guy want? 
<laughs> Unfortunately, there have been some recent events within the realm that I have that have what? Mm hmm. Hmm. What is that noise? Sounds like a chopper. Oh, it's the airship with with the guy with the terrible haircut space hey, on. Hey, you guys! Room for one more? Is he gonna let us borrow that thing? <laughs> We barely got to, like, use the, the actual ship. Now we're going to get an airship? How's it going? Um, so, how is everybody? Things all good over here? Hey! That was quite an entrance, Zip. To what do we owe the pleasure? Well, we just got done fixing up Broadleaf after all the, uh, trouble, so I thought maybe I could offer you guys a little help. That's right. The greatest brain in all the world is looking out for you. Lucky you, right? And if... And my first gift to you will be the free use of the Zeppelin. Nice, the Zeppelin, sorry. Fly, my friends, the skies are yours now. What? Your airship, really? Fly me. Amazing, think how many of us we can cram into that thing and we'll be able to fly around even when there's no wind. Exactly. You sure will, kiddo. And now I've upgraded the old girl with a miniaturized perpetual, perpetual fission reactor. She's zippier than ever in all senses of the word. Uh, um, yeah, I was gonna mention that. Mention what? <laughs> ha! Zippy's right, man. That thing's got your great hungry mug plastered all over the front of it. Oh, flippin' heck. Erg, I was trying not to think about that. Hmm. Uh, I had wondered if this might be something of an issue. Hey! You're kidding me, right? Ugly mug? I'll have you know, this is one of the most mathematically well-proportioned faces ever studied. Um. I must say, I wonder if it might be less conspicuous without the face in the front. Really? You too, Evan? You're breaking my heart here. Listen. Zip, it's not just about what it looks like. Did you ever stop to think about air resistance? That thing must cause a heck of a lot of drag. Sorry, but it's coming off. Come on. Come on. Time to go to work. We're going to take his face off the airship? But wait, you can't just... Man, he's so disappointed that his face is coming off that airship. All right, so uh, I guess let's get to work. I need to do some management too, actually. 